What was your welcome to the league? Ooh. <laughs> hey, on everything, bro. So, oh, who, who's your favorite NBA team? I grew up an Orlando Magic fan because of okay. Shaq and Penny. But then I, I quit them later because they just disappointed me too many times. Too many damn times. So, my welcome to the NBA. My rookie season, 95, we in Mexico City preseason. I'm with the Bullets. It's the year before they started calling them the Wizards. So on the team. You old as shit, man. They were still called the Bullets. Fuck you, dude. <laughs> so <laughs> it's me, C. Webb, um, Jawan Howard, mm. Big George Muir sign. You had a big ass team. Why did you have that many Mitch, big? Mitch Butler. Yeah. Calvert Chaney. Um, Robert Pack, uh, Tim Legler. Legs was out there? Um, uh, my, my vet, who was my guy, Bob McCann, and the Price Brothers. That was the- Both whole, of them? Mark Price, man, I played with Mark Price, bro. Damn. I mean, granted, he ain't, at the time, he wasn't, you know- You have to burn, say he was washed up, yeah. But dog. Man, just to be out there, I think he was one of the greatest point guards to play the game, but that's another topic. But so, Mexico City, we playing the Spurs. Mm. All right. So I'm at the time, I'm not understanding the whole preseason thing. Like, what didn't you get with the stars playing? Uh, right. So it was like, of course, you know that's that's pretty much the trash time. They're gonna play for the first three, four minutes of the quarter. And then and check out. everybody else coming yeah. in. So, <coughs> all right, I'm going up against David fucking Robinson, bro. <laughs> the Admiral. He was strong as shit. So, that was my note. He bust my ass. Yeah. He bust my ass, bro. It was nothing I could do with him. 30 points, 18 rebounds. Jesus. In 30 minutes. I remember that stat line. So he was cooking you good. Huh? Yeah. What? Wasn't nothing I could do, because usually, and I was, you know, I was young, thin. He was stronger. He was just as fast. He was just as athletic. And, you know, for like, you know, two, three dribbles to get to the basket, put it on the floor. He's what, like 7'1", 7'2", isn't he? He's like 7'2", he true, he true like yeah. yeah, he's true footer. Like us. Like us. You know what I'm saying? You see how big we sitting on this couch? Yep. Nothing I could do with him, dog. Bust my ass. So we played him again the second night. I'm like, all right. I'm going to get him tonight. Still bust my ass. <laughs> he ain't had 30, though. He had like 21. Okay. Know, shit like Better. You put up some fight. I felt good. Yeah. I felt good, you know, even though I really didn't do too much. He just missed shots. Right. But. That's the game. Hey! I, but no, that was my welcome to the NBA. I called my mom, everything, yo. Like David Robinson just kicked my ass. Uh, hey, look, let me tell you. It was two times in my life I ever called my mom bitching and crying. When? One time was I was a young boy, 14, 15 years old, playing against the Sixers, and Charles Barkley and Rip Mahorn, my two OGs, mm. beat my ass. They were playing, they was sent me Sixers. home. They was playing normal. They, they were not like sent me home. This crying. is a 14 year old kid, we're gonna take it easy. No, on fuck you. that. You out here on the playing sport. like you was Yeah. They knew who I was sent my ass yeah. home. And the second time I called my mom from Mexico City, I was like, Mom, I called my mom and my coach. I was like, Mom. You called her internationally. I was like, Mom, this you bust my ass, yo. I, because I never had my ass bust. Oh. Like, I never, I never had nobody really give me buckets like that. Right. You know, in college and high school. Like, you just didn't know what. Like, like, you didn't have nothing to do with him. Couldn't do nothing with him. I'm sorry. But, once I became, you know, got more experience in the league and went against David Robinson again, you know, I knew his certain tendencies and stuff mm. like that. But damn, yo, I don't, I don't know if anybody else had a had a worse welcome to the NBA moment. Thirty That's, and eighteen. I was saying because 
preseason, it's like you you're not supposed to be trying that hard. Like, why are you trying this hard? It's because he was like super straight, like, like super religious. That like he wasn't in party in Mexico City. I don't know. I don't, I don't focused. know if he was like, look, I'm gonna play this first game and get some cardio in. So I'm gonna play this little 28 minutes. Right. But bro, 30 points, 18 boards in like about 30 minutes. 28, 30 minutes. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I was like, shit. No, he bust my ass though, bro. <laughs> <laughs>